welcome back to my podcast, everybody. So today's video is an is a daytime chat with Jazzy, and I'm gonna be doing trends that we need to leave back in 2022. So first thing, the first trend that I think we need to leave back in 2022 is them long eyelashes. Like, what is it called? Um, the long mink lashes, and then especially with the bottom lashes, that needs to go. I don't like them. I, I think y'all look scary. Y'all be thinking y'all look good, but y'all look scary with them long lashes, and then y'all add the little bottom lashes. I think that's a little too much. Like, if you're going to do them long lashes, you don't need the bottom lashes. I think that's a little too extra because y'all really look scary. You do not look good. Y'all look scary. And then y'all be adding a little color, a little color into the lashes. No. I don't like it. I don't like it. I think y'all need to stop and go back to doing a natural looking lashes because that looks, it just looks crazy. It looks crazy. And it's, to me, it's not attractive. It's really not attractive when y'all add all that stuff on your eyes and y'all don't need it. It's too much extra. The second trend that we need to leave back in 2022 um, is the, um, the y'all, y'all, I don't know if y'all see this, but I be seeing this a lot on TikTok. Guys be getting a little fresh cut and y'all have the little, the little white line. That little white line, I'm going to show y'all a picture. That little white line. This little white line thing, uh, that, uh uh-uh. I don't know, when did this start to become a trend or thing or whatever to get the little white line when y'all get a fresh cut, but it looks crazy. Like, what happened to just (laughs) having just a haircut and a fresh haircut and you, you go about your day? What is this? Like, this is chalk on your hairline. What is that? It looks crazy. This looks crazy. So like a box. Like, I I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Like, when did this become a thing? When? This was not a thing years ago. Y'all was not getting on white lines years ago. This is new. This is some new stuff. And it's not it. Another trend. These see-through leggings, these black little see-through leggings, ladies, I don't like them. I don't like these. I don't like these. Because y'all wear these all the time, and they have to go. Y'all wear them too much. Y'all worn these these, uh, leggings. Y'all wear these with every freaking, uh, every event, somebody, a female is walking in with these. Every event, every event, you just want to show your butt. Every event, no. These got to go. I don't like them. Go back to the drawing board. I don't like them. Sorry. Another thing that needs to go, and we need to leave back in 2022. When y'all get in y'all braids, I don't know when did this also become a thing, but when y'all get in y'all braids and y'all get extra baby hairs, Please, I understand. Y'all be getting them extra baby hairs, knowing in two days it's going to look like y'all need to get your hair redone. If you're not going to be able to know how to fix your edges, your baby hairs, the same way or similar to make them look good again, don't get them. Because it looks crazy in about two days, and it looks like y'all need to get your hair redone all over again. So don't get them extra baby hairs. I'm going to probably try to see if I can find a picture of what I'm talking about. So I have found the picture of the baby hairs, the extra baby hairs I was talking about. And why is this looking all blurry? Why is that picture looking like that? This. You see them extra? That That's too much. That's too much. Way too much baby hairs. Like, 
some of that hair could have went right into them them stitch braids. That's too much baby hairs. Also, speaking of baby hairs, I see we got uh people adding. They got uh, you could add fake baby hairs to your hairline. What? 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 Y'all out here tricking people, acting like y'all got all these baby hairs. And these half of these baby hairs is extensions. Y'all be adding the fake baby hairs. Mm-mm. 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 That's, that's not, no, no. That's not a, that's not a flex to add no fake baby hairs to your head. No. Get rid of that, too. That's another thing we need to get rid of. Get rid of the fake baby hairs. Because I be seeing people with adding fake baby hairs. And then we got people who want to add all these long baby hairs to their head. Knowing dang on well, they can't do that. This is going to look like they hear, they going to get their hair mess, messed up in like two days. Two days. It's going to be done. If you ain't going to be able to fix it again like this, don't get it done. This need to go back to the drum board too. Go back. Them fake baby hairs go back to drum board. But yeah, that's all I wanted to say about that. That needs to go back to drum board. But yeah, another thing, we're going to move on. But another thing we need to leave back in um, 2022, supporting toxic behavior. Like, we really need to stop supporting toxic behavior. When I mean toxic behavior, I mean the fighting the relationship, toxic relationships, everything. We just need to stop supporting it. Like, them fighting reality shows, we need to stop supporting them. Like, it's getting to the point where we need to stop. Like, for example, Baddies South or whatever the show called, Baddies South, I never watched the show, but I be seeing clips of it from on social media that people repost. It is a bunch of grown people fighting. I think it is pathetic. I think at some point you're too old to be trying to be young and fight and act and wild. No, no, you're too old. We got people who is about to be 40 years old still trying to be young and fight and stuff. Come on, you look too old. They look old. They look old. The people that's on them shows, they look old. They don't look young. They look old. Half of them look old. I think it's played out. They that whole fight and reality shows, y'all had y'all time back in what 2017, and years before that, y'all had y'all time already. 2016, 2010, y'all had y'all time. That was back then when we was back in middle school, and we all liked, you know, we all like watching Baggers Club. That show, that was good. Y'all had y'all time. Baggers Club is done. There's no more Baggers Club anymore. We don't. Nobody watch that show anymore. So, the whole fighting reality shows need to just stop because it looks crazy. The same people, I feel like the same people, half of them people that's on them Baddies South show, some of them people, the same people that was on Bad Girls Club trying to still uh, fight and stuff. Come on now. You grown now. <laughs> Why are you still trying to do the stuff you've been doing years ago? Move on with your life. I understand, like, you can't find another bag. Like, I understand that's how you make your money, but find something else. It's getting old. It's just <sighs> played out. It's played out. It's played out now. Like, and I don't think others failed, like, I failed to realize that the more y'all watch their shows, you like their content on social media, the more money you're giving them. You're giving them more money. This world like supporting toxicity instead of supporting positivity. Like, how the heck do we support toxic instead of supporting positivity? Like, what? We just backwards as a whole community. Like, this world is backwards. We rather support people fighting and drama instead of supporting people who are actually trying to make something better of themselves. I don't like it. And we need to leave that back in 2022. We, in 2023, we all about positivity and growing. And making something of, something of ourselves. 
if we all stop supporting negativity, it'd be better. Start supporting positivity. Like, I'm all for supporting it positivity instead of support negativity i'm not with that negative stuff i'm not with that toxic stuff we need to just leave the toxic and back 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 there leave it back there but that was basically it of this podcast it's very short i just want to name a quick couple of things that i think we need to leave back in 2022 if anyone has have anything else to add of the things that we should leave please feel free to comment and let me know because we could do a part two of things that we need to leave back in 2022. So, yeah, that is the end of this podcast video. Like, comment, and share, and I'll see you in the next. Bye.